Have you ever seen the sticker called Christ Life? I had not seen it until recently when I was driving through a parking lot at Lowe's Hardware. There on the back of this you know, window, it said Christ Life. You know, just like the stickers that say Salt Life. I thought, man, that's really cool. I mean, that's, you know, it's attractive. It's, it's unique. It's, it's a good way to show people, you know, where you stand, what you believe. But then I saw something that kind of triggered a thought. And the sticker that triggered a thought was, you know, the little cartoon character, and he's using the bathroom on the word liberals. Is that what it means to have a Christ life? Does that bring people closer to God? Does that make them you know, want to have a Christ life? Or does a sticker like that, does a message like that, you know, reinforce in someone's mind that Christians are hypocrites or Christians aren't compassionate or Christians are hateful? Yes, it reinforces in someone's mind that we're no different than anyone else. As a Christian, you can still take a stand. You can take a stand for what the Bible teaches, for God's word, for morals and values. You just have to do it the right way. Think about it. When Jesus went into the temple, he drove out the money changers. You know, he was meek. He was very strong in his actions, but Jesus never sinned. Jesus was able to take a stand, right? But he did it in a way that did not create sin in his life. And that's the important part there, right? It's being able to take that stand, but do it in the right heart, do it in the right mindset, and do it for the right reason. Being Christ-like and living a Christ life means that we're bringing people closer to God. We're being an example, as Timothy talks about. We're showing them, hey, we're different. We have something that you need, and that something is the blood of Jesus Christ. The point is simple. Take your stand. Let your opinions be known, but do it in a way that glorifies God. Do it in a way that leads others to the cross and not away from the cross. Do it in a way that shows love and shows compassion and shows people that, yes, you care about things. Yes, you are going to be passionate about what you're doing, but you're also going to give honor and glory to God. So set that example. Be that example. I hope you've enjoyed this. My name is Nathan Tabor. I am with HandlingLife.org, an outreach ministry, and this has been a mini talk from my Mini Cooper.